so hey guys um i i've been home had to correct the video that went out today um some personal stuff was in the video that i thought i blocked out but i didn't so yeah if you guys saw the re-upload that is why but um i've been home had to correct that get that video back up um i'm about to go spray some mod podge on three of these letters that i've been working on so i'm about to go well i'm about to change my clothes and do that um and that's about it for the night babe is picking up Jaden from his magnet program activity that they had to do today so um she's doing that and I am, of course, home, like I said. And um, I think for dinner, baby's doing takeout tonight. Um, we had leftovers last night. Neither of us want to cook today. And, well, I won't say neither of us don't want to cook, but um, it's a little late to cook. So we didn't put anything on this morning. Then it's going to be a takeout night, so... Um, I'm not sure what she's picking up. She just told me that she's going to pick up takeout. So, um, I'm pretty sure I'll eat <laughs> whatever it is she brings home. I'm not picking it off. Just wanted to check in with you guys. Say hello. We are glad you guys are back with us. Since we were back like, um, we never fell off. <laughs> but we are happy to have you guys back with us. Um... I'll probably show you guys the progress of what I've been doing since I did say I've been working on um, some projects. Dang it. I let one of my brushes dry and I shouldn't have. But yeah, I'm going to let you guys um, see some of that. And that's about it. I'll check back in once Babe gets here. Hey you guys, it's me. I know my lips is dry. Um, it's about... Now and I'm heading out of town again for work. Um, I got a busy day today. I just got a busy day all week. My whole week is just busy. Um, just trying to take you all along with me. A little lonely, a little lonely on a journey. Um, I still got a ways to go. I still got about an hour and 20 minutes to travel to get to where my first destination that I'll be moving back to stop there to pick up a child and take that child to placement, another placement. Tomorrow I have a busy morning, then I have a meeting at 1, and then Friday I'll be headed to Georgetown and Myrtle Beach. I guess it's a lot right now just because I was out of town like for about four or five days I was out of the office, so it throws off my what I'm used to doing. But Next month, next month, I'm definitely um, trying to see all of my children in one week just because they'll be on spring break. So, uh, the first week of April, I'm going to be gone, 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 um, trying to get them seen. So, they'll be done. So, I got the rest of the month to just do whatever I need to do. Yeah, it's always a lot. Uh, I love what I do. There's no about that um, and I say that all the time but I'm tired my body's tired and I, I don't even think it's just from doing what I do now I just from me transferring to another position I just didn't have a break um, I worked all the way up to the day before started a new position the next day and even during the holidays it was on a go on a go on a go I did go to Florida but that was not something just to relax that was something where they had us busy from like 7 o'clock in the morning to like 10 o'clock at night. Um, that was an amazing trip, uh, amazing experience, and I wouldn't take that back. Um, so I'm doing all of this traveling. I'm in the upstate, traveling to upstate. And then I got to turn around Sunday and go back upstate because our oldest son has his um, acceptance date to the school that he's going to. Once we get some 
what is it, Neil? You know the stuff, the stuff for the school name. We will show it and let you all know where he's going. Um, he is going on a bull ride. Um, yeah, so we were very blessed. Before we left from Florida, he already had a lot of scholarships, but before we left from Florida, we were waiting on his one scholarship and um, we received it. He was one of the recipients. They only chose 15, 10 to 15 students, I think. But that was a blessing because it paid for everything, just about, well, everything, tuition, books, everything. And so I was very excited because he's going to a private institution. And I think this year it's like 55, 59,000, 55,000 a year, 59, something like that. So of course you all know it goes up every year. That doesn't change. Well, you know, we, you know tuition goes up every year um, for the majority of the schools. So next year probably, I think it's 55 this year or 59, but it'll probably be most 60,000 next year. And he has a full ride for that. Um, so I'm very uh, happy about that because it was his first choice. Now he had five other full rides but they were not his choices. So, you know, he was going, if he didn't get a full ride to the school, he was going to one of them other ones. Trust and believe that. But, you know, the Lord saw fit, and I'm just praying for this is where he's supposed to be, because the Lord made provisions, you know, out of all the applicants, he was one of the chosen ones, so I'm very blessed, very, we are very blessed and very grateful for that. The only thing I had to do, we have to do right now, at this time, is pay him $500 deposit fee so that's that and then we'll be getting him ready for um, you know school we already started picking up some small stuff for him things he'll be first dorm room we're going up there Sunday so we can get a better look at the dorms because they're all the I mean all the dorms are really nice and we'll do some filming they're all really nice and they're all the same price so it's not more to, it's not more to stay at one than the other um it's really nice so um, he could stay in the freshman dorm or he could just stay in one of the other dorms um so we're gonna go take a look so he can get a feel for what he wants where he wants to stay and we can get a feel for what he's gonna need in his room for, um, you know and he's been online and like to all the children who were accepted to this school they even made a little Facebook chat or something like that where they're all communicating so and then in for this school um, they have what they call intern and that's in January every January and in January they don't do any of their regular classes anything that they've ever inspired to do if they wanted to learn how to knit golf scuba dive they can do that during that month now with the scholarship that he has they will do intern for a week in January at Washington, D.C. And then the other weeks he'll come back and we'll, I guess they'll let us know something else he can choose to do. But I do know his junior and his senior year intern, he will go he will go abroad. Now he could also study abroad if he wanted to for a semester and his scholarship will follow him. But I'm hoping that he doesn't do that. I mean, I don't mind him going for that for in time for that month and he'll be with other students and as he gets older you know he'll be able to make his own decisions but right now he's still young he's a young senior he's only 17 he's a young senior he'll be young in college um, he's, he's mature he's mature I mean his focus is really good so I'm very grateful and proud of that but you know as a mom he's my first you know he's our first kid going off to college so of course I have all of these nervous a little bit I mean that's just that so, I'm glad I have you guys to keep me company but I'm so tired I'm exhausted I don't even know if it's a sleepy tired I think my body's just exhausted so how'd that go I wanted to stop and get a drink I drank I, well, I drank all of my water so I wanted to stop and get a drink but I think I'll ride it.
we have something planned with my sister and a friend of mine, her daughter and niece. So we'll see. We'll definitely see. Y'all see how my um, pop socket thing working? My big thick fingers not even covering up the camera. I like this pop socket thing. Let's see. For dinner, well, tonight, um, we're going to be meeting at a law firm for my oldest, our oldest son. Um, the school that he's going to, they're doing a meet and greet for, I guess, the students who were accepted to this school locally. Well, the ones that are local, so they can be brief. Um, cause of course, he doesn't know everyone. Everyone's probably not in the group chat, but the school is hosting it. It is going to be, um, my hair is white. It's going to be light, light refreshments. Um, it's going to be light refreshments, so um, that's that. check in back with you all in a little while so hey guys happy what is today wednesday um we i don't know if we told you guys i gotta pimp on right there i don't know if we told you guys but trey got into his number one choice for school he had a full ride to his number one choice so um that school is about an hour and a half away from where we live at now. So they are hosting a dinner in the Columbia area for the children that got accepted that live in Columbia. So they are hosting a dinner for them tonight. So we are currently waiting on baby to get home. She just picked up Jaden from his soccer game. So she's on her, her way home. Um, once she gets him settled, um, her, Trey, and myself will be heading to the acceptance dinner. It's only supposed to last an hour and a half, so that's good timing. So I'm com coming back and um, finish out two orders that I have to do. So, yeah, so that's good timing. So we are waiting for her to get here. Um, it starts at, starts at 6.30 and it's 5.30 now. So, once baby gets here, we'll be heading out because it's about, um, maybe about a 20 minute drive from where we live at. And I'm not sure how many students got accepted into this college. So, um, I'm not going to say the name yet. I'm not sure if babe wants to say it. So, I will wait for her. And once she says it, then of course, then I'll know then it is, it is okay to release the name of the college. But... I won't right now. But yeah, we are waiting for her to get home. Um, other than that, today has been a pretty good day. Yesterday was the first day of spring, and today it feels like first day of winter. <laughs> so yeah, this is really um, pneumonia weather. But yeah, other than that, today's been a good day. I'm officially official at work. We got our desk name tags today. <laughs> so that's kind of a big deal for me. But, um, yeah, just basically learning the systems at work. Um, today was my, sort of my day to drive. That's what they call it at work, driving, once you're working the computer. So, um, I was a little nervous up there, but I'm getting the hang of everything. I just need more practice. Um, the two people that are on the team with me. They have more practice than what I do because they've already been keying and I haven't been able to key yet. So, yeah. But other than that, work has been going good. I still still like what I'm doing. Um, I don't get up dreading to go to work. <laughs> but other than that, I'm not going to keep you guys too long. Just wanted to check in with you guys. Say hello. Um, I will see you when babe gets here. And then, of course... We'll take you guys along with us to the dinner. See you guys in a few. You have to vlog. Hey guys. I vlogged a lot. I vlogged too when I came home. I vlogged in the car. But I'm just checking in, telling good night. So, um, I did not take you guys with us to the thing. I thought it was a sit down, um, sit down dinner, but 
it was just like a meet and greet type thing. So we are back from that. Babe and I are eating our dinner for tonight. Hello. You can see. Go ahead. Hey, you. Oh, you can tell me big mic for this. Hi. <laughs> so we were just coming to say good night and end out the vlog because we don't really do that. Okay. Good night, you guys. Mm. And thank you guys for listening to me earlier and going along with me on my journey today. I'm very grateful for you. <laughs> So we'll see you guys in the next video. Excuse me. Bye, y'all. Say bye, B. Send me your location. Let's focus. Hold up, hold up. Hold up, hold up. Get right with you. I'm going to get right with you.